Father in heaven, we look to you today. We thank you for the plan of salvation. We thank you for the reality, that experiential touch. We know from experience that God, you are real. The reason we know you are real because you are living in our hearts. We know you have changed us. We know you have touched us. We know you have transformed us. You know, oh God, we know that you have, Lord, made something beautiful. We cannot explain it. Even like that blind man said, I cannot explain what happened. But what I do know, a man called Jesus, he touched my eyes and now I can see. I pray today, even in this service today, that persons might be touched by your spirit. May they know that we serve a real God, a God who is omnipotent, a God who is omniscient, a God who is omnipresent. Lord, you are here with us. You know all about us. And God, you are able to solve and come to our rescue today. We thank you for your people. Encourage them, bless them. Pray for those who might be discouraged, those who might be despondent, those who might be living in despair. Help them to know that, God, you love them and you care. And, God, you're going to see them through. We pray especially for some more sick brethren because the enemy has been afflicting many of them. But in the name of Jesus, we plead your blood today. We plead your covering over our church. Your covering over your people. We plead your blood over our children, over our young people. We plead your blood over our married couples, over, oh God, our adults, over our men, over our ladies. God, we plead your blood. And we pray you'll continue to have your divine way. Encourage some who need that encouragement. Remember those, oh God, they have been to the doctor over and over. There seem to be no redress. But I ask in Jesus' name today, you are still the God of miracles and power. And that is why we continue to pray and pray that God will bring results in our lives so that your people might testify of the reality of knowing Jesus as Lord and Savior. Thank you again for being with us. Bless those who are watching and worshiping with us online. We tend not to forget them. They are so important to us. And we pray that you lift their spirits. And we pray that you'll bring them to that place that they may know that God is real. Bless the furtherance of this service today. Meet the needs of every person. Touch those who need a special miracle today. Lord, you can do it. You're a miracle worker. Heal your people. We pray even for this virus that seems to be irritating your people. We pray that you'll deliver them and heal them and touch them. And Lord, may we hear testimony of God's goodness and God's mercies. Have your divine way again in this service and continue to bless and make us a blessing. And we give God the glory, the praise, and the honor because he alone is worthy. In Jesus' precious name, and the people of God say, Amen. Say amen one more time.